Hey guys, it's Alex, so welcome back to Alex's Sports News. Hope you guys are having a good day, and let's get in the video. Starting off with NFL news, we have the Seahawks extending Cam Chancellor to a three-year, $36 million deal. He is part of that um, insane core defensively that the Seahawks have that makes him one of the best teams in the NFL every year. And it's shocking how the Seahawks have been able to keep their core for this long and continue re-signing these players. And now he's down to list another player to resign. So do you think the Seahawks are going to be better this year, especially with Chancellor coming back from injury? Let me know in the comments below. And now to our next story. This one's been making national headlines and something I wouldn't usually cover. But this has to involve YouTube and football, and that's two things that I do or I talk about, so it's perfect. Is that NCAA football news, UCF kicker has been ruled ineligible to play football next season because of his YouTube channel because he would not demonetize his videos. This comes at a time where the NCAA is not allowing student athletes to make any money whatsoever, which I find completely dumb due to the fact that these athletes are get, making billions for these colleges, but they can't make any money. Yes, I get it that the scholarships give them the opportunity of free education. That saves them a lot of money. That's what some people might argue, but that's a lot of shit. While editing this video, I've noticed that this segment of this video, that my argument and what I'm trying to discuss might sound unclear or just all over the place. So I'm just going to try to simplify and make this as clear as possible now that a UCF kicker was ineligible to play and lost his D1 scholarship because he has a YouTube video and has monetized videos on it so he gets paid by YouTube when he uploads these videos and that's banned against the NCA for a student athlete to make money while he's playing for a school so that means that you can't make any money can't have a job whatsoever during his uh, career in the college and I don't agree with that and I think that's very stupid because Yes, they do get a free education, and that's what people like to argue, that that is good enough. They should still be able to make money while throughout the college. Everyone who goes through college and goes through the pros always say that that was the dumbest thing they've experienced. It just holds these kids back, especially that these kids are the ones that generate these colleges billions of dollars. That these maybe tuitions that they get for free of 30 grand and all that might sound good. The players that they get the scholarships are generating millions of money dollars so these tuitions don't really cover the amount of money they make those colleges so that's why I don't find it um, fair that these players don't get paid at all they only get paid by the colleges they should be able to make money their own way make their own business and like this kid should have to uh, um, lose his scholarship because of his YouTube um, career and YouTube channel and that's why I don't like this and I don't agree with it that I think you, um, NCAA players should be able to make money and that's the take I'm going with the UCF kicker that's what I hope you guys understand and let's get back into the video these people still need to like live and just making a video on YouTube and just making money from the ads is making someone ineligible to play which is really dumb but there's also things that popped up about this kid is that or guy is that he had a waiver that he could have signed with the NCAA that would have allowed him to have these videos on YouTube monetized. Just couldn't talk anything about football, anything about him being a student athlete, anything involving him with DCF, or anything involving anything with the football or any friends or nothing. So nothing could be about football. But if you look at his videos and his most popular videos and most of his videos, they're all about his football and NCA stuff. So it makes sense why he didn't agree to that waiver. Because then he pretty much wouldn't have a channel because all he does is talk about it. So I think this is really dumb. Now he lost his scholarship, and now he has to make a GoFundMe to raise it. I think he had like over four grand last time I checked. But this really does suck, and this is really stupid. And I hope they change the rule that student athletes should be able to make money. Like they can at least work a job or something. Making a YouTube channel is something he could have worked on for years. And he understands that maybe NFL won't be coming. So after UCF, he can still use this channel and make a profit. Maybe that'll be his career. You never know. So I find that incredibly stupid. I want to know what you guys think. And I think I really hate that this guy has to quit his football career in the pursuit of YouTube and that he loses his scholarship. But hopefully something happens. Something changes in the future because of this. Hopefully this guy gets his uh, degree because that's what he really wants. And yeah, let me know what you guys think.
And let's get along with the video in La Liga news as Sevilla signed Jesus Navas for a free transfer. He was released from Manchester City after playing a lot of years there. He previously played for Sevilla in the beginning of his career, but left off to go to England. Now he's back, you know, let me know if you think that's a good signing. And let's get to MLB news, starting off with the Rockies beating the Mets to score 5-4. The Rays beat the Astros to score 6-4 as Evan Longoria hit it for a cycle for the second time in his career. The Cubs beat the Diamondbacks to score 16-4. The Brewers beat the Cardinals to score 3-2. The Dodgers beat the Braves to score 3-2. The Red Sox beat the Indians to score 12-10. And the Tigers beat the Yankees to score 4-3. Hope you guys are, uh, enjoy the video. This is it. Please like and subscribe. And if you guys want to help continue to support the channel, please spread it out. Please tell your friends or anything. I want this channel to grow. And the way I want it to grow is by word of mouth, not instead of self-advertisement, which a lot of people don't like. So I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you guys want to help out, like I said below, and peace.